<laughs> What's going on, guys? Welcome to the 25th installment of the Nerd Purier podcast. Today, we have a special guest on Pokemon's English number one collector, David Pearson. What's up, David? Also, David, uh, you gotta... Can you hear me okay? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. I, I heard the feedback coming through your computer. I was like, for a second, I was like, what was that? You can, uh, you can just mute the live stream, and then you can just watch it. You can see my face and everything. You know what? I'm not even gonna do that, because I don't want to screw you up. So, you know okay. what? I'm gonna turn everything off and just act old and sit here like I got nothing to do. I'm geriatric and I'm just hanging out. <laughs> not much, bro. Okay, guys. So let me give you a little backstory real quick before getting David on the podcast. It was actually kind of hard. Uh, I messaged him and I was like, yo, can I get you on the podcast? And he told me that I either needed to give him a thousand dollars or five cards to complete his black and white base set. Somehow came up with a thousand dollars within Saturday to get him on. And, and then he told us we can start the stream once I paypal him. This is a true story. So okay, I'm saying nothing. If you think I'm going to contradict anything, you're not waiting for me to say nothing, right? <laughs> I mean, hey, you're the one who said the deal. What's up with that deal, man? Well, you know what? I don't think someone like you could just come out of the woodwork and think that you could, you know, you, you, you know, this whole white privilege thing that you're doing. <laughs> this day, okay? No, not for me. My bad. My bad. So, okay. In one of your videos, uh, the one where you reffed out like 20 reps of the 50 pound dumbbells. So you lift, right? Yeah. Thank you for noticing 20 reps. It was 56. But oh. yeah, <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Listen, listen. I I listen to your videos while I'm at work. I've only actually watched like four videos. I usually I typically listen to the videos. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna get closer <laughs> because now you got me angry. So what are you trying to say right now? Do you actually have a job? Because that, that actually is confusing. Who would hire you? <laughs> okay, <laughs> this is this is kind of funny, but my mom, she owns a business, so I work for her. <laughs> She's the only person that would hire me. Yeah, that, that explains a lot, okay? Yeah. Yeah. That explains a lot. That, that's perfect. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. She runs a cleaning business. We have this dermatology office we I clean. And, um, you know, I just listen to uh, your videos typically on there. That's how, actually how I found you was I was listening to Pokenomics or whatever, Jake and Raffi. And that's how I found you is their, um, their little video with you. Hey, you know, my, my videos are meant to be watched, not just listened to. <laughs> and by the way, I'm not going to put on the dermatology office because, you know, Maybe you might want to try a treatment or two as well. I'm not oh, sure. <laughs> dang. Okay, listen. I know I got the pepperoni face, but it's not my fault. Well, that's mom's fault too. <laughs> but how long have you been uh, lifting? Are you like seriously I've into it? My whole life in some form or another, some form or another, you know, due to the low self-esteem factor. Yes, I've been definitely lifting for a long, long time. The video you were talking about where you had like issues with that, like self-image and stuff. I actually related to some of that a lot. Like, well, I used to, I, I can't relate to it anymore. No, no. Once, once you make it and put a cone on, it pretty much says you were pretty comfortable with yourself yeah. at that point in time going forward. Yeah. Yeah. I'm pretty, I could get naked in front of anybody really. Like I could do it on the podcast right now. I just don't want to get my channel taken down or or to like traumatize oh, you. Oh, and that's okay. I understand. By the time you're done with me in this interview, there's a good chance the channel will be taken down anyway. So don't worry about <laughs> it. Yeah. No, that's great. Yeah, I've been working out for a long time too. Like since I was like 10 or something. You're not supposed to lift before you're 12. So apparently mom's really got it out for you. Just get you the whole D thing's working out good. So yeah. I, I was like fully done with puberty by the time I was 12. So like I could start early. It didn't even matter how about mental development did that stop at 12 too sir um no that was more like eight but <laughs> we don't talk about eight. that oh, okay. <laughs> let's go in the wrong direction okay. yeah yeah you know my mom my body may be overdeveloped my but my brain is like underdeveloped yeah that's i think what our what your followers all of us enjoy most about you so <laughs> yeah i actually made this funny video the video that that cone was originally to that was like probably the most normal thing that went on during that video but Oh man, that was so funny doing that. But that's funny. Um, continue. Yeah, Sorry. Go, keep no, going. no, no. You go. I will remember. I don't have Alzheimer's. <laughs> I just. Well. Okay. Thanks. That's nice. I guess this is gonna be a pretty short podcast. I'm glad. It's nice. Um, so, um, start the insults early and often. That's probably what you want to do for every guest. Good stuff. Yeah. Uh, no. So what, what is the deal? 
What is the deal with your name? I just want to understand. Are you Nerdy P, Nerd Perrier? Are you Gage? And by the way, if you are Gage, why did they name you that? What the hell were they thinking? Okay, so first of all, my aunt named me, and it was after Gage from Pet Cemetery. I don't know. That explains a lot. <laughs> I actually made up Nerd Perrier back when I was like, I think 11 or 12, and um, it just always stuck with me, and it's actually so cool. When I made my channel in 2017, like that name still stuck with me. It was the coolest thing I ever made up. My name is just the peak of my career. The peak. Yeah, yeah. The name itself. The pinnacle of everything you want to accomplish is your is your name. It's just my name, yeah. But how'd you how'd you come up with David Pearson? Like, what's up with that? Yeah, my aunt <laughs> named me. Apparently, aunts are doing all the naming these days. Yeah. <laughs> Through the years, my mom and dad didn't know what to do, so they called my aunt and they asked for a name, and that's what uh -huh. they came up with. Is that actually a true story? No, it's not. How much drugs are you on right now? You don't want to drug up before the podcast. You do it right afterwards. Yeah, yeah, guys. David told me um that, like, a few days before the podcast, I had a... What, what'd you say? I have to... What was the word i'm so i'm so slow no no i would tell you what it is but my alzheimer's just kicked in <laughs> Well, basically, you told me I had to get off the drugs, and basically, I haven't taken like any heroin or human growth hormone in a few days. You know, it's I've, I'm kind of getting those like those itches everywhere. The withdrawals, <laughs> I'm very familiar with them. Yeah. <laughs> from from what? Like buying po not buying uh, Pokemon cards? Videos. Oh, oh, okay. From watching your videos when you're doing all that crazy stuff, I know I can see what's going on there. Yeah. Wait, so you've actually watched my videos? Yeah, I don't just listen to them. I actually do both <laughs> because I think it's important to do that. That's yeah, you know, I make the time. You know, I. I've heard people on my actual <laughs> YouTube channel, they clean rat food just when they watch me and oh, all that stuff. I so saw that comment. Like, what? I actually saw that comment. You like, you responded to it. I yes. was laughing. That was hilarious. Yeah, and you're down, you're down scrubbing a damn floor <laughs> listening to me. That's what, that's what you find pleasurable. Sounds like your life's going well. Oh, it's going so great, man. My, my life is a movie. Like, it, it, it's pretty great. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching the video, and I want to be transparent with you guys real quick. I've kind of been having a hard time making videos lately, uh, something with my brain and quarantine. It's just kind of hard making videos while, uh, while there's nothing else to do in your life other than make videos, if you understand what I'm saying. But anyways, big thank you to David for coming out on the podcast. I had a great time. You know, I just thought to make a highlight real quick and that would be fun. It would be easy for me, you know, trying to get back into making videos even though i just uploaded every single day for 14 days but yeah make sure to go subscribe to his channel it'll be top link in the description and you know if you enjoyed make sure to comment and uh subscribe if you want to see more content from me i highly recommend going checking out my other content though first so you can make sure what you're getting into anyways guys i love you so much thank you for watching and peace